students at a better education and a better life. And that is why two Ukrainian students have come to Hilton Head Island. WRCB's Andrew Davis was there as they met their classmates for the first time, and he is in our Low Country newsroom with that story. Well, it all started with an idea. Heritage Academy principal Amanda Onan saw the footage from Ukraine and thought, how can we help? Just a few months later, she, the school, and the community have all stepped up, bringing two students from the war-torn country to our country for an education and much more. New students don't usually get applause when they're introduced, but Petrov and Tykon are a little different. They're coming to Heritage Academy on Hilton Head from war-torn Ukraine. I woke up at five, some explosions. Uh, it was actually scary, like everything was closed, uh, everyone in panic. Principal Amanda Onan came up with the idea while watching the footage from inside the country. Why not try to help some of the teens who've had it hard enough already while giving her teens a lesson in life. This is history in the making, and they have a counterpart, a friend in class that they can learn from, and maybe they might pick up on the language, or maybe this might inspire them to be a diplomat, or maybe this might inspire them to go into government, or to be somebody who's a missionary. Some of the current Heritage students say they believe everyone benefits from having the boys here. I mean, being able to bring them here and going to this school specifically because of how many variety of kids we already have, I think it's easier for them to fit in also. I think it's really cool that we got to bring them out and um, was able to make an opportunity for them to kind of not forget about it because you can't really forget about something like that, but to just distract them for a while. An opportunity to live and learn that these refugees believe is life changing. There's many interesting here, so I'm actually really thankful for this opportunity. I very, I'm very thankful to you, uh, to America. What do you hope they get out of this? An education, but most importantly, know that no matter where they're from, we love them. Now, the pair will be here for the full school year. They're living with the local family and learning American ways and customs. They've already made a trip to McDonald's, where apparently they ate their weight in burgers. Apparently, the hope is to give them a normal kind of experience. So if you'd like to help with even some small things like new clothes or gift cards for restaurants or fast food, Heritage Academy says anything is welcome. You just have to drop them off or contact Heritage on Hilton Head Island. Andrew Davis, WSAV News 3, on your side. Now, WSAV.